set. Hello and welcome to another episode of Aussie Jimmy. Today we are out here at Sunyu Do, Sunyu Island near Gunsan, the west coast of South Korea. Today follow me while I vlog our trip around this island. We're going to go for dog walk, we're going to go check out a lookout, we're going to go swimming at the beach and who knows what else we'll get up to. So come along and enjoy the journey. Check out this view, what a nice view here. A walk with the dogs. <laughs> get it, Kang. Go on, mate, get it. Mongdo Beach. It's these rocks, these round rocks, naturally formed like this over many years. So pretty. Whoa! Ocean cockroaches. Beach cockroaches. Beach cockroaches. What are they? Yeah, look at them all. No, 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 no. <laughs> you can find a shady spot up here, but there's no view, eh? Oh, you can find a shady spot over there, on the cliff. Yeah, let's go up there. Do you want to go in the swim, Kang? Water? Water? Perfect spot. Yeah, I'd go for a swim if I had me togs. It's lunchtime. She has made a beautiful duck bocce, which is spicy rice cake. And she's added some, looks like some capsicum, some peas, zucchini. Anything cabbage. else I'm missing? Some cabbage. Cabbage, nutritional yeast. Nutritional yeast. Flaxseed. Some flaxseed. Parsley. Parsley. Awesome. No. Yeah. Pollock as well. You know, people, they're selling lose pasta, lose mm. and cookie. Mm. I don't know what lose supposed to taste like, but I think it's pretty good. I would name. And for dessert, we've got some frozen banana with some cacao powder, some coconut milk powder, some cherries underneath and sprinkled with a little bit of stevia and erythritol. 
very much like a sugar but it has almost zero calories who needs ice cream when you can make this stuff at home so this is what it looks like in here on days when we've got a hundred percent battery it's fully charged 270 amp hour and we want to charge everything so I've got my mobile phone gimbal GoPro battery portable power bank and then we've got Gia's got her phone on charge up here I got my MacBook charging my portable has already been done it's fully charged and my phone is charging and we're still getting 75 watts of power to the house battery and we're also charging our 120 amp hour portable power bank it says 100% full but it's still got a few few more amp hours to charge the green light it turns to a green light when it's fully charged He's going for a swim, but I haven't. <laughs> Just gotta go under, eh? the end of the day sunsets here it's not looking too good today but i got myself this duck duck goose indian pale ale over at the local gs25 convenience store and just enjoying it here at the sunset not very nice i was actually here yesterday and we had a premium top notch sunset and i was hoping today we'd get the one as well uh, we didn't get to go up to the lookout today guys uh, you know that's what happens when you live in this kind of van life no time set no set time schedule like we stayed at the beach a little bit longer today and then we walked down and have a look at the shop see if we could find any souvenirs and stuff but there's no souvenir shops around here looks nice it does look nice
You can break one each. Mm. Savor it. And just stick it in your mouth and swallow it. Really in your mouth. No, not like Kang and Donut, like Kang and Eat. Taste like it. Little bug. Those ones are just noisy. Mm. Yeah, you can buy a whole pack of them. There's a whole. All right, so we're on our way up to the lookout. I don't know if you can see it, but it's right up there on that hill behind us. And we're going to go head up there. Should be a really nice view from the top. How cool is this little place here? Hey, let's come here and renovate it. I live here, bit of land, water. Looks great, here's the path up here. Up, up, up to here. Little observation dig up there. Let's go. I've been coming for a little bit now. I was just saying how most people on a hot summer's day will sit in the aircon and sit in an office or house and watch TV all day. But I think one of the best things to do on a hot summer's day is to go for a hike. Because you get all this sweat, you get a bit of a breeze coming in, cools you right down, and you get to experience some of the best views in the world, and Korea has many to offer. All right, so I think we got to the top. We've got to go find the lookout. I think I can see it through the trees down here. Oh yeah. Look at this. This place is nice. I really like it here. Beach that we were swimming on earlier in the video down here it was actually yesterday we didn't get a chance to come up here yesterday and the dogs we've been camped down here for two days they put a new road in down there took the dogs for a walk up around there and after our swim on the beach here yesterday which was before this pond jetty we walked up to the shops there and we got the beer and stuff and that's the only little place that we really discovered here and we walked up around this beach as well for the dog walk should i put the drone up out here mate
zip line over here goes from one side over to the other. To this little island down there. Beautiful clear blue water. The other beach we went to over over here, somewhere on the mainland, we had really muddy water, but here's just clear. And there's no one at the beach. Oh, we gotta go for a swim. One more swim before we pack up and leave this place. Sounds good. I reckon. So if you like that video guys, uh, please leave me a like, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please do. You know, I'm always making these kind of videos, living the van life in Korea.